It was like a couple days before the last day of school, so like everyone was pumped because it was almost summer break. My friend, he asked me, he's like, can you bring your vape to school? And I obviously said yes because he was like one of my best friends. Since the vape wasn't mine, I had to grab it from my brother's room. So in the morning, I snitched the vape and put it in my backpack. I took it and I went in the car like, hmm, nothing, nothing, nothing going on here. And I get dropped off and then I go up to the front gate and my friend's already waiting there for me. So then we went into the school and tried finding a place for like, you know, the vape. Like the hallways were like crowded with supervisors and the bathroom was the only way. So me and my friend went into the bathroom while my guy friend and his friend stayed outside and we started vaping. And one of my friends came in and says, what are you guys doing? And I blew the smoke right in her face. And then after that, we left and went into class. Little did I know, the girl that saw me vaping actually went to go snitch on me. So she went up to the office and reported me. So then I was in class and a supervisor comes in the class and goes up to my teacher and talks to her. And then the teacher says, where are you, Roxy? And then I raised my hand and the supervisor came up to my desk and she was like, where are your things? And I told her, these are my things. They weren't really my things. They were my friends things because obviously if I said my backpack was mine the vape was inside of it I went up to the office walking in with the supervisor and then I walked into the vice principal's office and she was telling me that I got reported for vaping and that she needed to pat me down and to look into my stuff and everything to make sure if I had the vape or not so obviously since this was not my backpack there was no vape inside And she got suspicious and asked me to tell her the truth, like, where is the vape? And I told her it's in the classroom, and I told her it was in a backpack. And then they brought my friend up and my backpack, and that's when my friend confessed to her saying that my backpack was the one that she had in the backpack I brought up to the office was not my backpack. And that's when the vice principal got really, like, mad and started saying, I cannot trust you anymore, like, you really disobeyed me. You really lied to me. I'm not able to trust you anymore. So then that's when my friend left and like I was in the office still and she was like saying she's going to have to email my parents and tell them that they had to come pick me up because I got suspended. So then when I got in the car, I was crying, obviously, and my brother was just ranting at me. And I got home and I got my phone taken away. I got grounded for the whole summer, just stayed in my house doing nothing. And no phone, so I was just pretty much sitting on the couch drawing or doing whatever. And that definitely taught me a lesson to not bring a vape to school anymore. And yeah, don't, don't, just don't. Oh my god, we totally jumped off the cliff and had to zoom all the way to shore because the dog chases all the way to the end. Oh!